Hello, my name is Grace. Today, I'm going to read the Bible story. The Bible title is 15 chapter Golden Cup and Israel. Exodus 32. Moses asked to the Israel, Do you want to follow God? You brought Who brought us to Egypt? The Israel answered, Yes, we will follow God. Moses went up to Mount Sinai again. He wanted, went there to talk with God. He stayed there for a long time. Moses might not come back, said the people worship to another, another. We need a God to help us. So they were right talking together and they're talking together and Moses was not coming for many days so they have said that they will make another god the people collected gold and many of golden calf they said this golden calf will help us this calf is our good now the people didn't obey god the people made God sad. One day, Moses came down from the mountain. Yeah. Moses was mad at the people. Who wants to f please God? said Moses. Some people came to Moses. They wanted to please please God, but another people be didn't come to Moses. Guess what, guess what happened to those bad people? They didn't listen to God. They all died. It was a sad day. The people began to listen to God. They obeyed God with all their hearts. 16 chapter The Repentance of God's People Numbers 21 Some people complained to Moses, Why did you take us here and make us die? Others complained too, We are sick and tired of mania. Others said, God doesn't help us now. Moses was very sad when he heard this. He got people. God helped Moses bringing the Israel here. God gave the Israel good food, but they wanted better food, better place, and they didn't want to follow God. They forgot the sad days in Egypt. They rested, resent God and Moses. They will be very sad, right? Um, like, think that you have what there is one people, so you have done very good to him. Like, you have gave some present. And like when he, she, he or she was very sad, you were like, say, it's okay like that. And you're doing very good to him. But like he was, he, he was saying that to another people, she's very bad. Then you will like feel very bad like that they have felt. God was 
sad because of the ungrateful Israel. God didn't protect the people from the poisonous snake. Run! shouted the people, but they couldn't get away from the snakes. God saved the Israel from Egypt. God gave them food and water. But is the Israel didn't thank God. Snakes bite and kill them. The people please God. Help us. Moses prayed to God for the people. Making a big snake with brass. Said God to Moses. Hang the brass snake high so the people can see it. If they see the snake, they will not die. Moses did what God ordered to him. Moses did what God ordered him to do. If the people saw the brass snake, they didn't die. God, people... God help them. God forgive them. Seventeen chapter the wall of Jacob. Joshua six. Jericho what is a fortress with a high strong wall. Look at this wall, said Joshua people how can we fight against the people of Jericho how can we go over this wall Joshua said God will help us God told Joshua to how to tear the wall down and Joshua told the people what God taught him this is the way God taught me they were going to tear the wall down by God's way. One first day, Joshua and the Israel went to Jericho. They marched around the city wall with the sound of trumpets. When they went back to their tents, are they doing? The people of Jacob were serious. They were afraid of Israel. Why don't they fight against us? The Israel marched around the city again the next day. One on the seventh day, Joshua and the Israel marched around the wall of Jacob. It was different from the other six days. They marched it around the city seven times. They, the people of Jericho were serious. Curious. What is going to happen? When the people heard the sound of trumpets, they began to shout the high wall. Of Jacob fell down in front of the people. Joshua and the Israel ran into Jericho and took over the city. Joshua shouted, God help us. Yes, next time I'll read it again. And today I read the Bible story. Did you enjoy and understand? Next time I will read. 18th chapter, The Strongest Man, Samson, Judas 13-16. Then bye!